inside, Laura. <laughs> when we move on now, a kidnapped 12-year-old girl is safe this afternoon. About two and a half hours ago, police shot and killed this man, suspected of taking the girl from her San Jose home at gunpoint. ABC 7's David Louis is live in San Jose with the story. David? Well, Larry, police say that the critical time to try to locate and to rescue a hostage is the first few hours. Thanks to a tip, police were able to find both the kidnapper and the victim at the apartment complex behind me. San Jose police were tipped off that 42-year-old Tree Trung Lee was holding the 12-year-old girl hostage at this townhouse complex. The suspect opened fire on the officers as they approached the apartment, fired several rounds from inside the apartment, and at this time, the officers believed that the victim was in imminent danger. Because of the gunfire, police decided to do a hostage rescue and force their way inside. The suspect again opened fire on the officers inside of the apartment, and one of our merge officers, which is our SWAT team, uh, took a shot at the suspect and actually hit him, and the suspect has been pronounced dead at the scene. 12-year-old hostage Taylor Vo was not hurt. However, she was taken to a hospital to be checked. She was abducted around 1.30 in the morning at this house on Taffy Court, where her mother Kim Nguyen lives with extended family members. Tree Trong Lee is Kim Nguyen's former boyfriend. Kim's father was outside when Lee arrived at the house. He saw someone walk up, pointed a gun at his head and asked where my sister was and uh, took, took him in the house, threatened my family, then my dad. And when he couldn't find what he was looking for, he took my niece instead. The girl was asleep in an upstairs bedroom. Witnesses said Lee fired two shots inside the house, although police did not find any bullet holes. Tree Trung Lee had a police record for driving under the influence and for domestic violence. When police caught up with Lee, Lee apparently had no intention of releasing his hostage. When, when officers are being shot at, they don't have the time to stop and ask what type of ammunition it is. If you're getting shot at, you're going to return fire. Police did issue an Amber Alert, but that effort was hampered by the fact that none of the witnesses to the abduction were able to take down the license plate of Lee's car. The abduction is now over, but the motive behind the kidnapping is still an unknown. In San Jose, David Louie, ABC 7 News. All right, thank you, David.